Hey guys, Dr. Deuce back again with another great set of music tech tips for you. Now today we'll be looking at shortcuts within the Logic Audio File Editor window, formerly known as the Sample Editor. The shortcuts we're covering today are Fade In, Fade Out and Silence. Okay, now let's get started. Okay, so I've got a piece of audio here that I need to tidy up. Let's have a quick listen. Said the battle goes on with temptation, it gets too much for you. Okay, so at the beginning, there's some background noise, a bit of dirt that I want to get rid of. Let's have a quick listen, say from about here. Let's play that back. Okay, so there's some leakage from the headphones, a bit of background noise, as well as the breath. I want to get rid of that breath because this is a double tracked piece of audio, and I don't want too much of that on there. So First thing you do is you highlight the section and we're going to silence this piece of audio. The key command for this is control backspace process. Great. There we go. All gone. Now, the next thing I want to do, let's have a quick listen to this part here. Said so the battle goes on with temptation. Okay. So the word battle that carries quite a lot of energy. The, the transients there are quite loud. So I want to reduce that. Now there are a couple of ways we can do this, but the method I'm going to use here is fade in. So I'm going to hold down the control key and press I. Process. And again, once again, I process. Okay. So let's have a quick listen to that. The battle goes, the yep. battle goes. There you go. A lot of the energy has been taken out, but you can still hear the words quite clearly. Okay, so the next shortcut I'm going to show you is the fade out shortcut. And I'll show you how this can be really handy when it comes to sort of shaping vocals and adjusting timings. Now, this piece of audio, let's have a quick listen. Do. In context of the song, that um, harmony should end at this point right here. So it's run over a bit too long. So this is how you're going to be able to use both the silence and fade out functions or shortcuts. First thing you do is you highlight the section that you want to get rid of. In fact, I'm going to go all the way down here and silence all of this because this is a bit of dirt as well. So again, control backspace process. Okay. Now that leaves us with quite a harsh edge right here. We need to fade that out. So I'm going to zoom in. Okay. And just slide back just a touch about here. And we're going to fade this out from about this point. So highlight the section up to there and control O process. And now let's have a quick listen to that. Do, do. There you go. All sorted. And in context of the song, that's going to fit in just perfectly. So there you have it. Control I to fade in, control O to fade out and control backspace to silence. I hope you find this tutorial of use and I'll be back real soon with more. Thanks for watching and take good care of yourself. This is Dr. Deuce, until next time, peace.